Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Alex, and today I'm doing such a fun video idea that I actually got inspired by someone else here on YouTube. I saw a video come up on my recommended page and it was basically styling fall Pinterest favorites. And I thought that that was the coolest idea ever. I took one look at it and I was just like, oh my God, I really, really, really want to do that. So all credits go to this girl right here who made the video. I haven't seen anybody else do it. I saw her video first and thought I wanted to take a shot at creating some of my favorite Pinterest favorites. I use Pinterest all the time, not only just for fashion inspiration, but for just inspiration in general. I never really advertise my Pinterest on my channel, but I'll link it down below if you guys want to look at it. I picked out six of my favorite fall Pinterest outfits. I chose ones that I had clothing that I could recreate with, so I'm really excited to do it. I have all the pieces here that I'm going to use, so so I have my phone here and we're gonna begin with some of the Pinterest faves. So this first one that I found is super cute. It's more of like a transition outfit. So I'll show you guys what I have to recreate that. I have the jacket that is literally almost exactly the same. This is from Princess Polly and this is a piece that I literally am gonna reuse like 500 times in this video because it's such a good fall piece. This is probably one of the outfits that I feel like I did the best job like getting pieces that actually look so similar to the picture. These jeans are from Zara and they're so fucking cute. Literally one of my favorites. They're super, super high-waisted. I feel like the wash of these jeans and the ones in the Pinterest are really similar too. And then I just have this little tank top piece. This is just similar to the little crop that she's wearing in the picture too. And I'm pretty sure she's wearing heels in this, but I think I'll do the black Converse with these ones because you don't see too much of the shoes with those um, pants anyways. But these are just my... Chuck 70 Converse. Yo! So you literally left the lights on everywhere. I didn't know where you were. I didn't know where the sound was coming from. My so bad. why do you always do that? I was having a hectic morning. As you can see, I was getting all this together. Morning, it's 3.20. I mean, it's 3.32. It 3 took me a long time to do that. Mariela, this isn't the time. Fine. Give me updates about your boy crush later. Okay, so now that I have all the pieces, I'm going to try them on and we can collectively decide if we pulled it off or not. All right, here we are. Can you see the shoes? She's also wearing some little sunnies with the fit. So I think it looks fucking good. I think it matches the vibe of the picture perfectly. If I was wearing heels, it would look even more similar because it has that like elevated look with the pants. I think I successfully recreated this one to be quite honest with you. Um, I forgot to mention, but the top is from Garage, just this little cropped tank. And yeah. I think she's a good look altogether. Okay, next outfit. I'm gonna be recreating this one for the next one. I have two different outfits that have this vibe where they have this like on the shoulder thing. So this one is a little bit harder to get everything like exactly like the picture, but it's fine, you know, it's okay. So for this one, the pieces underneath, I have these black long pants that look pretty similar. They're this kind of like formal fitting looking type of pants, but they're like more loose and baggy at the end. Those those ones are from Princess Polly and then the actual top it literally just looks like she's wearing a basic black tank top I just have this one this is from forever 21 I've had this forever it just looks like a basic one that I'll tuck into the pants I literally have not a single clue where I got this but it's just a beige knit little top right and then this would just kind of hang over the shoulders and then not up here. And I'm assuming that people kind of wear it like this so that when it gets cold, you can just put the piece on top anyways. In this picture, she's wearing Air Forces. Oh, well, I think she is anyways. I don't have white Air Forces. I did, and then they turned disgusting and then broke because I wore them so much. So I have these ones. These are custom Air Forces that um, I got for my birthday. And I think it gives off the same vibe. It also has these neutral colors, which will just match really easily with everything. She also has a black purse on. None of the purses in any of the Pinterest I got like exactly to the T correctly because I just don't have that many purses. This is actually Mariella's and I think it's thrifted. I don't really know where it's from but she does have some lifesavers in here so maybe I'll have a snack. But yeah this is just kind of what she holds on the side so we'll put that all together and see how it looks. So this is how the pieces underneath look. Now I'm gonna take the sweater and I'm assuming she does a little something like this. It's a little bit more like that actually. 
Honestly, this is kind of cute. Getting inspiration like this does me so good. I've literally just created six outfits that I can wear this fall season just by making this video. Can you see the shoes? With the fit. I like it. These pants literally are perfect. Look how they reach the bottom of my feet. I fucking love it. Tall girl problems, am I right? But yeah, this is how we look. This is how the second pin has turned out. I'm a fan of it. I think it looks cohesive all together with the black. Kind of like taking some more formal pants and dressing them down a little bit. Making it look more fall with the knit sweater that you could also throw on. Okay. So this is the third pin that I have. It's a lot more filled with layering and I'm gonna be using the same jacket that I did in the first one. I have pieces that are similar to these, not exactly the same, but I'm still gonna try to make it work. Okay, so for this one, I'm gonna be wearing these pants, which have the same vibe. They're the long, flared out pants. These are from Princess Polly. They do have this little tie thing in the front, but I think I'll just tie them a bit higher and try and make them like not noticeable if that makes sense and then to layer underneath I have this little white turtleneck then layered on top of that I didn't have a Nike sweater but I do have a crew neck that is very similar color um, it just doesn't have any logo or anything on it I think this whole entire outfit is actually from Princess Polly this is not sponsored surprise surprise but I just have a lot of Princess Polly items and then I'm gonna take this jacket wear it on top I also have this little gold necklace lastly she's literally wearing this same exact converse that I have I'm pretty sure so I'm just going to pair them with these obviously so let's see how it turns out so this is how it looks without the jacket on top I think it looks cute just like this and we can see converse peeping through the bottom of these legs let's try it out all together this is a perfect example of layering for fall and keeping warm this outfit is probably one of them that would work the best in the types of falls that we have in canada for sure i think this looks really cute i think it works well together and it looks pretty similar apart from the logo I love these shoes. I think they're like such a good piece. So versatile for all the seasons. Works really well. Honestly, I was more nervous about this outfit because I was just like, there's so many elements to it. Like maybe it wouldn't look good together, but I proved myself wrong because I think this is actually a really cute outfit all together. I'm gonna go look in the mirror because I want to see it. I love it. I literally want to like leave the house and strut the streets of downtown Toronto in this outfit. I'm not kidding. So I fucking love this jacket. I'm so glad I got it. I literally got it last year, fall season, but we were in COVID and I never got to fucking wear it. Hope you guys like this one. I don't know if I'm speaking too soon, but this is probably one of my favorite outfits. Okay, so we're moving on. So I thought this one was really cute. Just like one of those like baggy, comfy fall outfits. And it also has the same style where they kind of like throw something over their shoulders. I didn't have a shirt that matched the one that she was wearing perfectly, but luckily I did find this in my dad's closet. This is also gonna be oversized, which is great. This is from Mango Men's. It is like a striped blue and white, which I still think will look cute. I think the one in the pin was just like only blue. And and then these are just some really comfy sweatpant material pants, but they have that baggy look to them. To go on top of it, I just found a crew neck that had the same colors. You're obviously not really gonna see the front of it because it's gonna be laying over the top, but this is just an oversized like navy colored crew. And she's also wearing a strapped purse. This is the only long black strap purse that I have. That's Kate Spade. In that pin specifically, you can't see what shoes she's wearing, but I'm assuming to go with the more of the casual look she's wearing sneakers i'm just gonna pair it with the reebok sneakers these are cute they also have like some blue details on it let's go try that outfit out okay so this is how the pieces look without the thing on the top she didn't tuck in her shirt but mine is a lot bigger than hers looks i just thought it would be nice to tuck it in give it a little bit more shape and then we'll do the body cross purse lastly we let this drape over the shoulders there we go i'll show you guys the shoes as well you can't see too much of the shoes but you have the little white sneakers poking out the bottom this is definitely more of like a super casual oversized type of outfit personally i don't dress like this with like everything oversized but i'm honestly not opposed to it i think it looks cute i love the style of wearing like oversized button-ups with different outfits i think that that's definitely in right now and a lot of people are doing that do you like it my look do you like it thank you 
He said yes. Also, I changed my clip to a navy one so it matched everything. I did get all these clips that I'm wearing from Amazon. Anyways, moving on. In this one, she's wearing a little white tank with a big oversized button-up white shirt and then more light wash jeans. What I have is, it is really wrinkly, so just ignore that, but this is from Princess Polly. I didn't have a tank top that looked exactly like the one that she was wearing, which I did have this little crop tank, which is like similar vibes. It's from Zara, just a little dainty white piece. For my jeans, these lighter washed jeans from Princess Polly. These ones have like an asymmetrical button and they're a bit bigger on me, so they are slightly more baggy, but I do think that that's gonna look cute with this vibe. She's also wearing white sneakers with it, so I think I'm just gonna go ahead and wear these ones again. She is wearing a little Percy purse. Hers is a blue one and I do not have anything that looks like that. So I just decided to switch it up. I'm gonna do a little brown purse. I still think that's gonna look really cute with it. This is from Princess Polly as well. And let's see how it looks. So here's the pieces without the top on first. Honestly, this one gives more of like a warm country's fall instead of a Canadian fall, like I mentioned. Oh, sure, cute. And then with the little purse on, I feel like any kind of colored purse, this would even look good with like a black purse or whatever. I have these glasses laying around and I know she's not wearing glasses. This is kind of cute, no? This kind of like ties it together. It gives me more of like a librarian look. This is so cute. This is like if we were walking down Hollywood Boulevard in the fall, the California fall. It's giving me model off duty. I'm a fan. I definitely like this outfit a lot. This last one, I definitely think I had to improvise the most. I think it's still gonna work. Let's see. For the shirt, I just have this little black tee. And for the skirt, I literally only have like two skirts. This is from Shein. I actually literally just bought it for a Halloween costume. <laughs> it looks more like a tennis skirt than the one that she's wearing. And then, of course, the last outfit, we have to use my favorite piece again so i think that this one will look good with that i think she's wearing docks in this picture and i do not own a pair of docks i do have a pair of combat boots but they look like they're purchased from walmart and they might actually be from walmart i don't know they're hand-me-downs i decided i'd just wear these boots they have like a similar vibe but they're definitely not the same as the docks because they're more like chelsea boots these are from aldo she's also wearing a black purse so i think it's just really easy to just pair this one with it as well so yeah let's try on our last outfit um fingers crossed it looks good because i really don't know if it will okay so this is how the two pieces look without the jacket and with the boots on um i tucked in the shirt because it was a bit longer and hers looks like it's like cropped right under the boobage area also also, I took my hair down from the clips because it was getting kind of fucked up every time I changed my shirt. And this girl's hair's down, so I might as well keep my hair down as well. Just ignore the back of my hair, so it's kind of fucked right now. And the purse. I'm kind of obsessed. Just a little bit. Just a little bit obsessed. Just a touch. I'm definitely a fan. I felt so unsure about this one and turns out genuinely one of my favorites. I know I said the other one, like the layered one was my favorite, but this one is probably my favorite just because it's something that I never fucking wear. But the fact that I saw it on Pinterest and was able to try it out for myself makes me want to wear it. Let me know what you guys think. But yeah, I'm so happy that I got to do this video. I thought it was the coolest idea. If you guys did enjoy this video, don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel so you guys don't miss out on fun videos like these ones i will try to do more for maybe different seasons and once again my pinterest is down below along with my instagram and my tiktok and my twitch if you guys want to follow that as well other than that i hope you guys have a great day hope you guys took some outfit inspiration from this and i will see you guys in my next video i love you guys bye